Hello, Corey Sizzlepits back here with my good buddy Cole. And as you can tell, we uh, might work at the same place. Who knows? We're twinsies today. Okay, so we have some light sauces today. Uh, Cole isn't doesn't do too well with the heat. So. A, little, a little nervous. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. So he's he's dealt a little bit. I've I've tricked him with a few sauces and he didn't he didn't respond too well to that. So we'll we'll keep it down. Uh, these these hot sauces actually don't have Scoville units. Couldn't find inf any information on them, but uh, I've, I've tasted them before. They're not that bad. So the first one we have up is Patio's Potion. So hot pepper, garlic, onion, carrots. It's got all sorts of veggies in there. Um, and it's, it's a little liquidy. I know some of the ones I did yesterday had some had some thickness to them. But this one, do you want to do, do it on your burger? Do you want to do it on your finger? Or? I'll do it on my, in, in the spoon, I guess. In the spoon? Yeah, okay. Sure. Cool. In the spoon. Burgers just for you. You wait for me though. Emergency. Don't. Oh. Oh, that's it's thicker than I thought. Yeah. It, it looks, yeah, it looks liquidy, but really, I can, I'm gonna do some. It actually, yeah, kind of. I'm gonna do some on my finger here. Yeah. All right, you ready? Yep. All right, so. Cha. Okay. Okay, you can taste the heat though. Right away, there's a very instant heat. Yeah. It's and it's sour. It's not. It's not strong. It's just kind of. It's kind of shocks you with a little heat, and then and then it's gone. Like, do you taste like the sourness to uh -huh. it? You can definitely get the the earthy tones. You know, it says it has it has carrots in there. Do you do you taste it? It's kind of a savory flavor. Yeah, this is this is good. This would actually go good on a burger with barbecue sauce, such as the burgers we have here. Um, so I I like that one. It's not too impressive as far as heat. Yeah, you're, you're, yeah. I mean, I, I mean, he's he's a yeah. Sissy when it comes to heat, and it's still not that bad. Exactly. So. This one might be a little hotter. Uh, now I'm gonna start. So to this sweat. is the <laughs> Adobo Loco uh, Adobo Loco Hawaiian hot sauce. So it says it has ghost peppers in there, <laughs> but it, I mean, what? It's probably not bad. I, if I had to guess, maybe a vinegar feel to it. That that one had some vinegar as well. So okay, this one you, you're for sure. sure for sure needing the spoon. Okay. Yeah, that's that's like water. Okay. Go ahead and. If you can, uh, I see. <laughs> it's gonna trip out. Just jiggle it a little bit. Yeah, yeah. there it is. That, that one's like water. So. Yeah, I have a little chunker okay. in mine, dude. Mine's gonna be hot. I have, I have, I have a seed in mine. That's not true. It's not true. <laughs> okay. okay. Hold on, let me. Okay. Cheers, mate. Ooh, it smells super vinegary. <clears throat> That's not my cup of tea. Yeah, that one doesn't taste very good. That is very vinegary. Um, yeah, it's like with, spiced vinegar. <laughs> that's exactly what it is. Yeah, that's that's vinegar with some some heat in there. Um, Doesn't taste good. Burns your throat. And gives you the hiccups. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> gives him the hiccups. Yeah. Yeah, it's not it's not that bad. <laughs> he says it's not bad, but he are you like low key dying inside? Or are you okay? No, it's not that hot. Okay, I just have the hiccups now apparently. But well, I mean, okay. Yeah. So both of those were were vinegary. Out of the two, definitely the patio's potion. Would you agree? Yeah. That one is just that one's hotter, but it just doesn't taste good. Yeah, yeah. I would I would rate these kind of under. There's under par for sure. Um, and I would say, you know, th this one being a little bit hotter, it is. Um, I'd say around 150, mm, maybe 120 thousand Scovels with the, the the patio's potion being significantly under it, like maybe 60 thousand Scovels, and that's just an estimate. It's my own personal opinion. It could be something way different, but since I knew they would be a little weaker, and this is this is why you, he he brought food and he brought uh, some coffee, some dairy heavy coffee, um, is because we did our grab back as well. So I went ahead and, and pre pulled, and my brother actually is the one who identified the last one from last episode. It was a I believe a Chinese habanero. So thank you for that, Ryan. But Coles is this bad boy here. I'm not again. I'm not familiar with what it is, but Ryan, if you could identify it or anybody in the comments, please feel free to do so. It looks hot. Um, they have been thawed. They've been in my fridge, so hopefully they'll have a proper consistency. There's his, and this one much more intimidating, and I'm quite frightened. <laughs> my my saying goes, you know, the uglier the hotter. So this thing, it's ugly. It is ugly. Now. <laughs> You know, I think this might be a ghost pepper. I don't know. I really don't know. So again, if you, if it looks familiar to you, please let me know. Um, this is, 
I'm not going to like this. You're not going to like this, but yeah. we're going to have a great time anyways because that's what we do around here. You ready? Did you just eat, eat the whole thing? No, don't eat the, the don't eat the stem. Right, yeah. okay. But I, you know, if you can get ninety percent of it, you're yeah. you're, you're, you're <laughs> you ready, dude? All right. You got to chew it up and swallow it, and then yeah. don't run, don't run from me, okay? okay? All right, let's go. Okay. <clears throat> At first, it tastes like a bell pepper. Now it's a little hot. I'm sure it's gonna kind of continue to get hotter. How's yours? Mm. Yeah, mine's it's popping. And, and like the back of my throat, it's getting consistently hotter. <laughs> yeah, but you're you're good. You're you're okay. Yeah, it's not like super <laughs> o o overwhelming. Oh, fuck. But, oh yours is. Well, it's, it's now it is. Yeah, uh -huh. it's kicking up. No, no, I got. I got my burger. <laughs> good idea. Oh. Yeah, that was, it was a slow bird for me, but it's there. Oh, mm -hmm. it's there now. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, Lord have mercy. Mm -hmm. oh. oh God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. It's like a very consistent burn. This keeps going and going and going. Yours is probably way higher than mine, dude. No. Oh. oh, fuck. Oh. You want one? One of those? Mm -hmm. I don't think so, dude. Is it? You want to eat this bit? Yeah, dude. Right here. That has like all seed in it, dude. Oh. Ooh, yours tastes. Ooh. Oh, I'm dying. <laughs> yours is way hotter. Oh, <coughs> oh fuck. I... Ooh, oh, my God. <laughs> yours is way hotter. Ooh. Ooh, yours tastes so bad. Oh. Ugh. Oh. Jesus, take me now. <sighs> take me. Oh, I'm crying. Oh, I got tears. <sighs> Oh, okay. So, I can't speak. Oh, man. <sighs> well, I hope you guys like, like this episode. If you're ever in the mood for furniture, come see Cole yeah. at Garrison's home. Yeah. He's a great salesperson, very knowledgeable. Um, and he'll, he'll get you hooked up with whatever you need. All the way from your living room to a bedroom set, he'll make it happen. Garrison's home, 6435 Crater Lake Highway, go see him. Great dude, has a little bit of a stutter, that's okay. He'll make it happen for you. Have a good one, guys.